environment as environmentalists continue to prefer innovative solutions to address some of the key challenges facing the ocean environment. The integrity of ocean ecosystem is being threatened by climate change, pollution and overfishing. In this report, our correspondent Funke Adesoji sought the opinion of an environmentalist in finding solutions that will protect the ocean and accelerate progress towards the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. The ocean economy is worth around $2.5 trillion and 40% of the world's population depend on the biodiversity and the services it provides. Seas also absorb about 30% of human-generated carbon dioxide emissions and more than 90% of the excess heat in our climate system. But the integrity of the ocean ecosystem is under threat as the effects of climate change, such as ocean warming, acidification and oxygen loss, pollution from plastics, chemicals and other human waste, and the impacts of overfishing are just a few of the existential risks. There is a renewed call for ocean environment preservation. We have um, other things. I mean, we have some. Con I mean, some businesses like fisheries and so on that are exploiting. These are exploiting or taking advantage of the ocean, um, uh, of the services that the ocean provides. But as we have said, and part of what we need to do in relation to the theme of today is to revitalize or to make sure we restore or we continue, I mean, we increase our effort in restoring the ocean to a level that will be sustainable for us and for the future generation. If it were a country, the ocean would be the seventh largest economy in the world. But global drives such as the reduction in single-use plastics and greenhouse gas emissions are critical for the future of the ocean, hence an urgent need for actions at all levels. Marine pollution is not by government, but government needs to regulate. Uh, somehow development has to go on. And when there is development, there's supposed to be consideration for the environment. There are several instruments that are used in controlling or in managing most of the activities that we are doing. Before now, people just do things. You can, uh, you can acquire an environment and then you do whatever you like. But as I said, there are several instruments. Uh, one is environmental impact assessment environmental baseline studies and some other things in order to consider the environment. We advise government to also uh, create a special judiciary or special administrative courts that can tackle marine pollution, that can tackle maritime crime, as the absence of those type of laws allow perpetrators of such acts, criminal acts against the ocean, criminal acts against the state, to sometimes go scot-free or spend unnecessary amount of time, you know, in trials. Partnering with environmental organizations on projects that maximize the benefit of aquaculture while addressing some of the biggest challenges from habitat degradation to overfishing will mitigate the impact of climate change, destructive 